What's up guys, uh, in this video I will be reviewing the base icon Ronaldinho, the 89 rated card. I think I packed him in the, the base icon packet, the icon swaps, uh, the 8 tokens. So um, yeah, we're playing as a, a central camp, or the only camp, in a 4-1-2-1-2 narrow, just behind um, Alessandrini and Alex Teixeira there. Um, instructions stay forward and get in the box with crosses so we will be you know making runs into the box and helping out the two strikers almost playing as a third striker so uh, let's get into the gameplay uh, one of the main things that, that that sort of shocked me when i when i first played with this card is that i mean when i packed him i thought you know what it's 1.4 mil i think he was worth um it's it's a, a great pull but his stats, you know, 80 pace, you think, is he really going to play, is he really going to fit this meta, is he really going to, you know, play well in this game, and he shocked me really with how much better that, how much better he sounds than than his, than his stats, uh, he does not feel like he's got 80 pace, he, he beats the likes of Varane and Gamers in foot races all the time, and he's just got something about him which he... He's so hard to be bullied off the ball. His ball control is immense. Do any type of skill, any type of move, and the ball just st seems to stick to his feet. And another thing is his shooting, his finesse shots inside, outside the box, his finishing. It's just amazing. He rarely misses chances for me. And you know, as you can see, he's involved in pretty much everything I do. I, I don't know how he got this penalty though. Um, it did make me laugh when I saw it, but I haven't really um, had the chance to take many penalties or free kicks with Ronaldinho. Uh, the odd few I have done, he, he, he's done well on it. I think he scored one for me, a free kick. Um, there you go. And then neatly tucking away the penalty. But yeah, he's just... Like, the ball just sticks to him. And look how fast he seems there. Look at beating to the... To have a, Tavernier, sorry, um, for raw pace there. Uh, 80 pace does not justify it at all. And is, you know, look, see that? He'll win the ball straight back. Ball sticks to his feet and he's got the pass as well. He, he's just, he's crazy how good he is. Um, uh, Ronaldinho is a player that I've used in previous FIFAs. Um, in draft, yeah, maybe. But see what uh, the ball bounces straight back to him. He's just so hard to dispossess. Uh, yeah, I've, I've not really used him, and I'll tell you what, he's made this game so much more fun for me. He, he just, the way that he carries the ball, and the way that he plays this game, you know, is, you might not think he is meta, but he just makes the game so much more, so much more fun, and look there, just ball control finishing, it, it, he's so good, and I'm so happy I packed him. You know, Brazilian icon. You think, well, it could be Ronaldo, Pele. But this Ronaldinho card is crazy good, and uh, I do recommend him to anyone looking for, a, you know, a talisman, someone to play that cam role who can create, can score, can hold on to the ball. Look at that! Look at that! He's he's just too good, and I think he's he's got something like nearly double the amount of goal contributions this game to me, he's involved in absolutely everything, every single attack, and uh, look, 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 a burst of pace there, so I do recommend him to anyone who's looking for, you know, an icon, not, you know, one of the top icons, but, you know, I, I when I packed him, I did think, he's not really worth the price that he is, but he so is, he really is, he, he has shocked me how good he is on this game. He really has. Yeah, look at that. Just taking defenders out of the game like it's nothing and sliding it away. He has been amazing for me. He really has. So guys, that was the gameplay with uh, this Ronaldinho card. Uh, let's look at his stats there. As you can see, he played about 40 games with him there. 49 goals. 29 assists that is just amazing really what's that 78 
goal contributions in 40 games, nearly double. Uh, contributions in games, five star skills, four star weak foot. I think, obviously, bar five star, five star. I think the five star uh, skills is more important than five star weak foot in this game. Um, just gets out of so many tricky situations with uh, the, the dribbling skills and the actual skill moves that, that he can perform. I do play with Hunter on him. Uh, so that does give him a, a good pace boost, uh, 91 acceleration, 90 sprint speed. Uh, so I was saying um, in the gameplay that he does feel fast and 80 pace, maybe that's why, but he's still 90 pace, he feels faster than that, he really does. He feels like one of the fastest players on the pitch. Um, and with it, with it only being 5 foot, what, 5 foot 11, uh, 85 agility, 84 balance you wouldn't think he would feel that fast on the ball but he really does uh, and you know 95 shot finishing 93 attack positioning he's just got amazing all-round stats and 75 stamina can let him down um, especially playing as a cam that probably is one of the positions that uses up the most um, stamina in a game but I have man stay forward which means he doesn't do much tracking back, especially with the uh, low defensive work rates, 82 strength as well, like I said he's just so hard to push off the ball, um, 93 composure, I, I don't know what else can I say, uh, one downside I would say about this card is his work rates, medium low is not the best for an attacking player, uh, with his just medium attacking uh, work rates he doesn't make as many runs as you'd want him to um, and obviously low defensive work rates it doesn't track back at all so he just sort of sits in that, that number 10 hole uh, position I would like him to make more runs but that's pretty much the only bad thing I can say about this card so guys that is my review on the 89 rated base icon Ronaldinho uh, there'll be more icon reviews and other FIFA videos coming up in the near future on this channel. This is a new channel, so um, please like, comment and subscribe for more. It would be much appreciated. I'll start streaming on Twitch soon as well, so be sure to follow my channel. The link will be in the description. And uh, that's all for today's video. Uh, I'll see you next time.